Members of parliament from across the political divide have defended the handshake between President Uhuru Kenyatta and NASA leader Raila Odinga and call for an end to early 2022 campaigns. In a news conference today, the former lawmakers say the handshake offered an opportunity to resolve long-standing national issues and the building initiatives, rather building bridges initiatives activities should not be diluted by the vicious Kenyatta succession contest. More so, the gesture of the reaching out to the perceived losers should be lauded. In a democratic process, this unifies a nation and cultivates the necessary spirit. Finally, we call all Kenyans to end this unnecessary political rhetoric and support the president in his rallying development agenda. We need to bring civility and decency decorum in our political communication. Our people are still fairly vulnerable. As we all know, we have many fault lines in this society. And I think as leaders, we have a responsibility to make sure that we, we, don't, we don't fan situations. The association supports the president's effort and fight to end corruption in this country. This is the greatest vice and danger to this country. This vice is a big enemy to economic growth and development. It takes about one trillion Kenyan shillings in, an, in any annual budget. We condemn the view that this fight targets certain communities and individuals. Our position is those who steal and prada public resources do so as individuals and should be dealt as such. 